Okay, I've already done a video why the word under is banned in my teaching bay and you can use this link to find that. But now let's talk about the second scenario where the word under is banned when players say they're not getting the club under the ball. We really don't want to do that. It doesn't promote solid striking, so let me talk about that in more detail. Okay, in part one of the video I spoke about how the word under and getting your shoulder under your chin is banned. Well, it's also banned from a point of view of try, trying to get the club under the ball. People will come to me after playing golf for 25 years, and for those 25 years, they've been under the misapprehension that they believe they've got to get the club under the ball to elevate it. They've watched golf on television and seen a professional hitting a divot, and not fully appreciated that the divot actually occurs after impact so they're doing exactly the opposite they're not trying to get the club under the ball you must appreciate that a divot is a byproduct of a good swing a player actually isn't a top player trying to take a divot it just happens because of the angles they're applying the golf club into the ball they're applying on a descending blow it squeezes the ball keeps going into the turf and the divots the byproduct of that so if you're trying to falsely get the club under the ball, lift it, elevate it, scoop it, call it what you will, you'll inevitably end up either hitting the ground before the ball, your wrists will break down at impact, you'll hit the floor, it'll scoop, you'll get mud between the ball and the face, it'll go nowhere or you'll thin it. So it is just a recipe for poor striking if you think you've got to get it under. Remember, you're trying to trap the ball, squeeze it, get those pictures in your brain rather than under. The club is going to come down, on average, for example, with a 7 iron for a tour player, it's about 4 degrees-ish, 4.1, that will crush the golf ball, the divots, the byproduct, and the grooves and the loft and the compression, that'll lift the ball, it doesn't need any extra help from you. So don't try and get under, think more about squeeze it or trap it, compress it, get those words in your vocabulary, that will allow you to get that nice solid strike on the ball. I hope you found that video useful and helpful, don't forget to subscribe on YouTube, also you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter, also give us a like on Facebook, if you'd like to get in touch with me or book a lesson you can visit me at solidgolf.co.uk and I look forward to helping you playing more solid golf.